Uh, good day everyone. This is Simplified Likeli. Uh, quickly, I want to uh, uh, tell you about uh, IMF, International Monetary Fund. I know some of us are not really clear about what uh, are the operations of IMF. Okay, IMF, also known as the World Bank, uh, uh, is a 189 country uh, member organization. That is, it has 189 countries as members, in which Nigeria is one of them. And of course, our International Monetary Fund, uh, their role is that once you are a member, you uh, contribute uh, some amount of money to IMF, which is called quota subscription. So for example, let's say, you know, I said we have 189 country. If United States contribute, let's say, uh, $200 and Nigeria contribute just $50. Now, what that means is that uh, the special drawing rights of United States will be more than the drawing right of Nigeria. Because whatever you put in the IMF as your quota subscription as a country, determine your drawing right. That is, when you have challenges as a country, how much you can borrow from IMF. So what determines that is the quota subscription you have made to IMF. And, um, you know, uh, Nigeria, over the years, what we've been trying to push is to make sure that our quota subscription in IMF is uh, getting higher so that we can always have access to borrow at any time we want to borrow. So, uh, now, the, 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 the quota subscription any country has also determines the right you have to vote or to contribute uh, in IMF generally. Of course, IMF generally uh, is an organization established to enhance a uh, balance of payment in member countries. So they want to make sure that international trade is well regulated and there are no issues and of course they are also there that should any member country is in crisis the IMF will be there to help but of course they are going to help you based on the uh, quota subscription you have as a country and don't forget that that quota subscription is what determines your special drawing right and also determines your voting or your contribution in IMF uh, activities so uh, in my other uh, video, I'm going to be explaining why is it that Nigeria keeps borrowing and borrowing and borrowing and it seems we always have access to borrow money. And then a lot of people are asking questions, why do Nigeria borrow so much? What is the effect of this borrowing? What are they spending the money on? All of this I'm going to be doing in my next video about Nigeria and its debt. But uh, this video is just to explain uh, IMF as a body, what it is meant for, and uh, uh, if you are a part, if you are a member, what are the rights that you have. So basically, uh, when you are a member country, you will drop what is called quota subscription. That's like the contribution you will make, a deposit you will make in IMF. So it is that deposit that determines the right you have or the extent of the right to withdraw or borrow from IMF. So I'm going to be looking at all of that in my next video about Nigerian debt, what are our special drawing rights and the, the likes. Join me again till I come your way. I remain, I remain simplified. Thank you.